hey guys hi youtube welcome back to my channel i'm sorry i'm starting this video with a wig but i'm going to remove it when i'm cooking because i came to the market and i didn't plan to start this video right now i was supposed to start it later today i wanted to make my i mean make a stand for my hammock but that one later because it needs uh, like a design and a good stand a very good strong stand so right now i'm in the market and i'm going to cook something very nice today i know you've seen it on the title and also on the thumbnail <laughs> so i'm going to buy the ingredients so there's one thing guys with the cooking in the village there's so many african food you can cook like ugali um beef fish and i've done all of these like sometimes i get i run out of ideas and i'm like it's interesting other other cultural foods like tacos um pizza fufu i've tried fufu but we don't have all the ingredients in the country it's really hard to find them i'm not lying so and it's really but I'll try, I'll try, I'll try. I think I saw okra somewhere in the supermarket or in Migori. So I'll do my research on fufu. It's not the easiest thing to do. But today, kindly just allow me to do this one. I know it's not, in, uh, it's not African, but you know, the world now is becoming a village. And I think we can do anything, any like any food anywhere in the world. Food is art. Food is really interesting. And African food only it's it's interesting but i think we can also do other type of foods like spanish food italian food french food and uh, yeah it's going to be interesting so let's go <laughs> so i need uh, carrots. carrots yeah i'll also need one carrot okay. mm. can you kindly hold this for me this is I need one carrot tomatoes for 20 shillings. Tomatoes? Yeah. Good ones. Like zile za kachumbari. The ones? Kachumbari. Yeah. I would have bought avocados, but I have a lot in the house. Mm -hmm. Guys, I'm not buying avocados. Um, yeah. What else? No, onions. Mm -hmm. Give me Onion. one big one. one and a small one. Yeah, that's okay. Oh, just found money here i don't know how it got here this is 50 shillings and there's so much uh wind so my fire will light really quick it's going to be quick i just turn it towards this direction So the fire is lit and ready. I'm just going to put up my beans and maize. So these are my ingredients. I'm going to cook I have tomatoes, uh, green onions, we have beans, I'm just washing it and soaking, I also have maize, I have carrots, onions, tomatoes, lemons and cabbages and of course I know I might add a few more things like the spices and everything. So this is what I have right now, this is going to act as my table. My fire is lit. I'm just going to put this on to boil because it may take a lot of time. At the end of the day, what can you Sasa. Okay, so what I want to do right now, I've, I've been soaking. Oh, this thing is scratching. So I've been soaking the beans for a few uh, minutes. And... Uh, just going to wash it my camera setup I don't know if it's clear this is the first day I'm cooking here I normally cook outside in the outside kitchen but because it's very rainy now I'm scared and I'll just cook here 
because I needed a video for today, guys. Uh, I'm just going to put it in the water. I'm going to put it here. I don't know if the fire, I mean, my charcoal will, will won't be lasting because of the wind. There's so much wind. Or maybe if I can block this place here like this to avoid um, to avoid uh, I mean to protect the wind so the beans are here oof, oof. oh the next thing I want to wash is the maize So right now I'll just wash my potatoes onions carrots and everything and just cut them into pieces and get ready i just added another i just added another round of charcoal and this is how it looks like i just <laughs> So this is how it looks like a mixture of beans and maize. So let's wait for this one to cook. So right now I'm just going to clean the ingredients one by one. First of all I just remove the outer cover of the onions. Then because I'm going to use some raw tomatoes and onions, I'm going to wash them with lemons. The washing with lemons just started like a few days ago. I'll be getting um, vinegar too so that I can use it to wash especially my beef. hope you can see what I'm doing here. Oh. My table situation is not the best. It's a DIY table. Let me use the dirty water to wash the dirt from this first. Then I can now wash it with fresh clean water.
lately i've just been trying to use the lemon to clean everything because it's like it's a plus you know so it's kind of getting to me to be using lemons to clean these things so while the beans and maize are cooking i'll just leave these ones inside the lemon water then i'll cut it so right now i'll just peel the potatoes some people cook with the outer cover but i don't do that i peel it off yeah so i'll be doing this for the next few minutes Right now, I just want to grate the carrots. Cut all the green onions without recording. Thought I was recording. Now you just leave it like that. Then the tomatoes. That's why you got in double to get four water. Hey, so we can be tired. Okay, so the next thing will be I cut these ones into small pieces. That's too small, that's like crepes. I have an outdoor flower here. I don't know if it will do well or it's going to die. Maybe she will put, I mean, have a big pot. So, see how it looks like. So, what I'm going to do is cook the potatoes. Uh, then I'll mix it together. Yeah, I'm going to mix it. So, first thing. Okay. 
red onion. Then next, I'll add my tomatoes and carrots. Same thing, almost. chili pattern you can deal with chili okay next I add oof, these ones the green onions it smells so good the next thing to add is the potatoes sweet potatoes That looks like then I'll add water for it to cook with it. I don't want a little water. I, I mean not a little but more. I just need a little water so that it cooks so that my burritos won't be having so much soup in it. Because Jiko is very slow, I was cooking in on my gas now. So time to add the cabbages. I can't wait to try it. <laughs> so I'll do the rest of that. And this is a lot. And I'm alone. I don't know where I'll take it to. Because if it's in the fridge for so long, it's not going to look good. So that's the results. Let me taste and see how it is. <laughs> 